topic for the week, which happens to be embracing change. All right, so I just came up with this topic because, um, you know, sometimes we have difficulty with, you know, what I call embracing change, you know, keeping up with, you know, how things change. You know, I got these images here of, you know, the past and the current, you know, like, you know, assembly line work. Um, you know, years ago there was the Industrial Le Revolution and, you know, throughout history things always constantly change. And that's my point for this. You know, whether it be assembly lines, uh, you know, communication, you know, things like, you know, just something like mail. You know, mail, you know, carried over, you know, on ships, uh, the Pony Express back in the 1860s, which was something that only lasted about 18 months, but that was a very, uh, you know, efficient way of delivering mail where they had the, uh, I guess, the cowboys, you know, ride the horses, you know, X number of miles, and they would literally hand off the bag of mail to the next rider, and they would get from point, you know, they would get all the way across the country uh, just doing it that way. But uh, like I said, it only lasts like 18 months and trains and things like that. You know? um, but you know, there's just so many things that are always changing. I just use these examples you know, like telegraph, you know, Morse code was a way to communicate. Uh, eventually the phones came along, you know, and even the, the cell phones where we now have our smartphones today. Uh, things like fax machines, uh, you know, where back in the sick fax machines, uh, we know a fax machines first started out. Uh, it would take an hour or two to get a fax. Uh, and today it's instant, you know, with email. And so, you know, then of course radio, you know, again, uh, progression to the day where everything, we have internet and everything going on. And so fast forward, uh, you know, there is constant change. That's my point is, uh, us as individuals have to uh, accept that. Uh, we, we cannot be complacent and just you know, wanting to settle for it all, I just want things to stay the same. Uh, you know, and I'm talking about positive, you know, um, but not, you know, negative things. But, you know, so you cannot settle for complacency. Uh, you cannot be complacent with your life. Uh, embrace positive change. And, uh, you know, you must embrace the journey to achieve your goals. Uh, you know, that's the whole, you know, all of us have goals in life, with, you know, being family, professional, you know, other things that are going on. So you have to embrace the change in your life. Whether you like it or not, sometimes I mean, that we don't like change. There's a lot of resistance to change. But the thing is, um, you know, the environment we live in, we have to adapt to change. And so you must, and you know, never, never, never quit. Uh, in our case, we're talking about you know graduating uh, or you know whatever your endeavor may be. Uh, don't quit it. 